What's up YouTube? This is Cooking with Doug. I'm back again with my 5.3 quart Cook's Essentials Air Fryer. And tonight for dinner, I'm going to make some country style pork ribs. Now I've had this marinating for pretty much all day and I um, took it out of my refrigerator about an hour ago to let it rest on my island. Um, as you see here. I used this guys and mixed it with uh, you know I followed the instruction in the back and I also added some vinegar um, so that's been sitting in the refrigerator all day and uh, like I said we're gonna do it in the air fryer um, and then glaze it with some sweet baby rays alright guys now the great thing about this is you can put your own type of rub on here whatever you want to use I'm going to keep it simple and to the point today. I'm going to use this. I like the way it smells. And mind you guys, remember, my um, ribs were marinating all day into that original marinade. So it's going to be f filled with flavor. So I'm going to make sure I get all of this. I'll be back. All right, so this is what it looks like with my seasoning on there. And remember, get all sides of it. Get it nice and good. All right. And by the way, my country ribs are not boneless. Usually you see that in your market. Mine has a little bit of bone like right here. Right here and then like right here. So right here going down on each of them. But the bone is just like, it's not a lot. So just wanted to show you. So if you see boneless, they, at, when I was at Walmart last night, they didn't have any boneless. So if you see boneless, go for boneless. But if not, it's still fine. I don't know if all of this will fit in my air fryer basket, but we're about to find out. All right, all of them fit right in there. Nice. Okay. So let's get it in the air fryer. All right, guys, I'm going to do 370 for 20 minutes. Flip at 10. All right, so this is what we're looking like after 10 minutes. We're looking really good. Um, so I'm going to flip them over. All right, I flipped it over. And just because I just feel like being extra today, just on this side, I added some Miss Dash to it, just for some extra kick to at least one side of the rib. All right, guys, I got my Cook Essentials Digital Perfect Cooker in the house. I'm gonna make some mashed potatoes in this. I just hit the rice button and it's boom. Man, this smells so good in here, man. I can't even, I wish you guys could smell it. Mm. I'm telling you, this stuff is really good. It makes your meat smell like it was smoked. It smells like smoked ribs in here right now because of this marinade. All I gotta do is hit the rice button now. All right looking pretty good so that's 20 minutes y'all so now I'm going to put the baby rays on it all right I'm just gonna do one side first so I'm gonna do I think I'm gonna do like 400 uh, degrees for five minutes and flip halfway that should be good Yeah. Shout out to my kitchen gadgets group on Facebook. This is my copper chef crisper. So I'm going to spray the other side of my asparagus real quick. Alright guys, 
my ribs are basically done. So I'm gonna let them chill out on the bottom while I air fry my asparagus on the top. Got the super convention going. So this should be fine. Alright, so I can take this off. Alright guys, let's take a quick look in here, hear that, I'd say they're done, nice, alright guys, it's time to eat, it's my mash, it's everything there, let's get it plated, alright guys, there you have it, we are finally done, alright, so I am ready to dig in, and have a bite. All right, let me cut a piece off for you guys. See how it's, it's not a sharp knife, but I'm just gonna tear into it just to get a piece out. Put some of this gravy on it. We're gonna take a piece. But of course, you first. Mmm. Bam. Yeah. Juicy. Tender. This is really good, guys. Really, really good. Definitely want you guys to try it out. Try some of this. That's great. Well, I'm going to sit down and enjoy this. But, before I go, I have to give a shout out to Shirley, the admin of my air fryer group. Because she just made this uh, yesterday and um, she actually reminded me that I needed to make it because another shout out to uh, Janice in my air fryer group. She made this a while ago and a couple other people did too. I just forgot to make it but when Shirley made it, it reminded me. So shout out to both of them because I really stole from both of them <laughs> their recipes. So big up to y'all. And by the way... Um, a link will be in the description to my air fryer group. Uh, we have over 22,000 uh, members in there. We share recipes, best practices, blah, blah, blah. If you're thinking about getting an air fryer or if you have an air fryer, come on, click that link and join. We'll get you in. But other than that, hit like if you like it. Remember to subscribe. If anything, thanks for even looking at my video. It's Cooking with Doug.